This exhibit is incredible. They took the height at the hips and they made it to the same height as Big Al 2. So they have made all of the bones scaled up to be the same height. And you see that, <clears throat> excuse me, the proportions, the femur is so tiny in comparison to Big Al's. But you have the tibia and fibula, and then you get down into these metatarsals, wildly different proportions of the, of the hind limbs. And the forelimbs are wildly different as well. But the size is the same. The necks, very similar. The head, gigantic. So I love the fact that you can take this giant Pika Pika and you can put it against Big Al 2 here. And they're staring at each other, kind of eyeballing each other, going, you want to go, bro? You want to go? Now, my money is on Big Al 2 because though the beak would peck the heck out of you, Big Al 2 has hand claws and feet claws that though the Pika claws are sharp and big, Big Al's just gonna win. I'll bet you Pika's faster. Oh yeah, Pika can fly. I don't know if it can still fly at this height. I think this is one of the coolest ways of taking a modern dinosaur and contrasting it with a 150 million year old dinosaur. And this exhibit has just put the biggest grin on my face.